July 25, 2023. Ukraine war, approximately nine years and six months into the invasion of Crimea. Day 517 of Special Putin's operations. Big picture. Ukraine is melting Kremlin vehicles and weapons at an astounding rate. Moscow's attack against the Danube ports of Ismail and Reni place NATO protected property at risk. The northern half of the Eastern Front has seen the majority of infantry fights and artillery duels. Russia is drafting 70-year-old men. Dnieper line. Putin must be trying to trick Ukraine in Hesson, they only fired 250 projectiles in the last 24 hours. Kremlin attacks around the Dnieper were well reduced from any previous month. Artillery duels outside Nikopol and possibly Anahota. Nothing of note in infantry movements. Zaporizhia front. Ukrainian patrols continued to harass the front. Heavy fighting continues west of the Morkioli. Roughly four different artillery duels. East front, Donetsk. Heavy fighting, roughly six artillery duels, three distinct ground assaults by the Kremlin. Neither side reporting any line changes. Bakhmut area. After clarification of gains at Andiivka and Kashivka, there are reports that the Kremlin may be ordering a withdrawal from those villages. At least four artillery duels in the last 24 hours in this small section alone. Moscow's forces made attacks in three directions west of Bakhmut, no line changes reported by either side. Oskol border front. Both sides are claiming the Kremlin's troops made gains in their attacks west of Kovalivka and Kamazanivka. Having reached near the crest of the Long Ridge, it remains to be seen what sort of troop commitment each side will make. Northern border. Unusually well-spaced artillery attacks in Kharkiv. Said another way, each target was approximately the same kilometers from the next along the border and included an unusually high number of targets here. Black Sea. In attacking the Danube, the Kremlin is risking striking a number of international vessels that work on the Danube, as well as striking NATO-protected territories and properties. In the words of Michael Buffer, let's get ready to. Edited for copyright. The city of Yevpatoria was without power for a few hours after an explosion at a power hub. Ukraine world related. Russia is moving the draft age to 70 if there's anyone who has lived past 55. Ukraine is reporting that to date, its allies have given roughly $244 million for humanitarian mine removal. A recent estimate suggested that with 500 teams of Demonis, it could take nearly 900 years to remove all the mines placed by the Kremlin. Ukraine new tactical reconnaissance drone, the domestically produced Serco, has been announced as being in mass production using parts from numerous nations. The drone is designed to fly pre-programmed routes without giving radio signals that can be tracked or disrupted. Germany has dedicated to sending two Skynex air defense units. We aim to bring more. Like and subscribe.